Wow, they put the sticker on two sides. They were playing. I love that my super delivered this to me since the delivery driver decided to leave it downstairs. Hello. If I said I'm buzzing you in, you can assume you can leave it on my floor. Everyone else does. This is the part where I act like I didn't know what this was. Before we get into the summer FabFitFun box, you guys need to know what this is. So it's a subscription box. They have one for every quarter. It includes six items that you get to choose. I think each of the six picks, there's like six or seven options for each. And it's a mix of health, beauty, home, wellness. There's a lot of, a lot of, a lot. I'm gonna make content tomorrow with this so that it's up and stuck ASAP Rocky. Okay, what does this say? And the text is pretty large. I could have probably read this six months ago, but my vision's gotten worse as of late. I don't, can't. Mm. I think it says bottle stoppers, but I'm also going off of memory from what I ordered. And this text is pretty large. Like, yo, Starbucks is no joke. I got another so well. You know, I'm a sucker for swell stuff. Last time I got the swell bowl that I've been using for my fried rice. This time I got a swell snack container, which I think is perfect for storing my nuts. Cause you hear that? Can you say airtight? Ah, okay. What is this? Oh, just in time. Cause they were cleaning the pool yesterday. I mean, it's not warm yet. <laughs> At least it's not Caribbean girl who lives in Canada warm yet. Unless it's 25 and up. I'm not wearing shorts, much less, much less a swimsuit. And since my uh, surgery, uh, I don't even know if I'll be wearing a swimsuit this summer, honestly, because uh, that scar is scarring. I'm super excited. I'm gonna take this off as safely as I can because truth be told, I'm gonna do another unboxing and I have to pretend like this is the first time, even though it's not the first time. Like a virgin, open for the very first time. Okay, I'm, that's not how the lyrics go though. Oh my gosh. Can somebody say beach party? Okay. Okay. I feel like going like bullfighting with it. It's so long. I like it. Super soft. What is this? What is this? It is free. I've heard of this brand. I've never tried it before. Again, I can't see what it is, but because it's italicized, I'm guessing it's Innisfree, right? Memory. I think this is the sunscreen. Can you confirm? And we have, why are you open? Hello. <clears throat> Did someone in packing take a little one, two for themselves? Snatching these was like a cheat code because I already know I'm gonna love these. I like to get a mix of things that I like, brands that I know, and then something that's just way left field. So I think those are my six, no, there's one more. What was this? Ooh. I don't remember picking up Fenty Beauty. What could this be? It's giving the Fenty Beauty packaging, right? So it's gotta be. But what is this? Is this an illuminizer? When you get work messages at 7.52 p.m. That part. And nine to five, where? Okay, so boom. Hello. Yes, it's a liquid, a kilo, what? Ooh. Okay, first of all, right side up. Liquid kilowatt. I have the powder one. I still have it from years ago. You know you're not supposed to use makeup for more than whatever the numbers are in the little symbol. Mm -hmm more than half of my makeup. As long as I don't break out again and I don't have to spend 500 a session on a dermatology appointment, we good over here. So that is my spring box from FabFitFun. If I haven't told you already, because I feel like I didn't, you can get 20% off with Alicia 20 or Alicia 20 gift. I highly, highly recommend it because like you see, it's not like other subscription boxes where they give you teeny tiny samples or super obscure random brands. Like the last time I did it a couple of months ago, there was two brands that I didn't know, but I went on their websites and they were legit. They weren't like, you know, some brands are like struggle brands. I mean, everyone's gotta get their coins. So I like getting small brands, niche brands, startup brands, honestly, cause it gives me a chance to try something. And usually something new on the market that has a, like a novelty to it. Like they've done something different. I like to have a mix of playing it safe with brands I know and then things that are like, oh, this is different. Like, oh yeah, I don't know what brand this is. The cocktails are gonna be cocktailing this summer. It's so funny because I drink so much less than I used to. 
full of cocktails. I might have a glass of wine time to time. Before I go on a good tangent, just to wrap it up, if you want to try out your own items and get your own spring box, you can use, I feel like this is going to fall and then I'm going to be sad that it's dinged up. You can use Alicia 20 gift. Okay, back to the rest of the vlog. I swear the theme of this vlog is not hauls, I promise you. This is the last one for a long time. Don't judge me for having this just out here. I think I have to, at this point, throw it away because I tried to curl my hair yesterday and it just stopped heating up. Just got stone cold. And then it got hot again, but I was like, I don't have time for this. So let me show you what I got from Sephora real, real quick. Where's that tan? I tried to get this during the sale. I've heard so much about it. I'm actually gonna pop them on right now because I want to try and see if they're better than the Wander brand that I did get during the sale. Those ones are just all right. They're really pretty, they're gold. And I need to edit the video today. That just reminds me. I need to post my Sephora haul that I did a week ago. I'm so behind on life. But I'm excited to try these from Topicals. And as per usual, samples on samples on samples. I don't even know what this little thingy is. Does it smell it? Yeah, it does. I don't know what it is though. Where's my phone? This is called D Dry Shampoo. You know what? Is this like something you shake or? How am I supposed to use this? Foolishness. Oh, here we go. I mean, that works too. Ah! There goes half of it. <laughs> it smells good though. I don't even know how to turn off the camera now. Now that I got dry shampoo everywhere, let's get back to editing. How about that? Let's just stick to the rivers and lakes that I'm used to. This is a cute package though. Pretty good for on-the-go travel. And now that I know how to pop the whole lid, if I ever do buy this, I can use this as a refill. <sighs> I swear, never a dull moment when you lose vision. There is no change. In fact, it looks worse. Is that just me? Am I crazy? It doesn't look like it did anything. Lord of mercy. I went on a 10 minute walk. Not even, maybe less than 10 minutes just to exchange the topicals. I'm just gonna try one of these and they're already cheaper, price per value than those ones. It turns out that's for dark spots, which I don't have dark circles under my eyes. So she recommended this and it was right at the register. So I'm like, yeah, I'll get one. But that walk, I might have to pop a Tylenol and keep it low key tonight. Not that I had like crazy plans or anything. I didn't have plans other than to pod really, but even for cooking, I'm like, I don't know if I can cook what I meant to cook because that requires me standing longer. But a girl's gotta eat. I love key sunglasses. If you've been watching me for years, there was a time when I bought a whole bunch. Over the years, I apparently have like this weird habit of just either losing the arms of one or them snapping off. These were my favorite. I've worn them on nearly every trip since I got them and I always get compliments, but uh, yeah, that part. So I was thinking about MacGyvering the situation, <laughs> like Frankenstein, like stitching them together. So using this arm on this one, because I don't care if they don't match up. Like, if you're really watching that, then there's not that much going on in your life. Like, if you notice that and you have to say something about it, I'm gonna have to get you a side hustle, a gig or something. I don't business. These are gifted to me. My Chanelis. I don't know if I showed you, but I did post on TikTok last month. And they are very similar to these ones by Key. And you know what? I heard this secret. I don't know how true it is, but all sunglasses are made in like the same five factories in China. Like sunglasses are something that they're not made in like the finest part of France or exclusively in Italy. These are multiples, exponentially, square root times something or the other more expensive than these. And they are so similar. And I mean, honestly, I can't tell you, oh, these are so much better quality than these because I love my these. Ooh, that's it for me for a Monday. I literally can't believe I'm still in pain. Like, 
I think the problem was I felt good and then I started doing the most, which wasn't even that much, but it was enough. And now I'm on a bender. Like I called the doctor and they're like, yeah, that's natural. That's normal. You just need to keep it low key. I wasn't going to go to Aerial Silks or anything this week, but I was like, damn, I don't know how to sit still. You haven't figured that out yet. <laughs> Not there being a random piece of the flooring. <laughs> Can't see. Swiffer saves the day. One boy said he was delivering my phone. Silent sniper. Usually I can hear them walking. They don't always have to knock, but he called asking for the buzz and then didn't buzz in. This is so boring. I just told you guys earlier this afternoon there would be no more hauls after the topical thing. Well, I forgot that I ordered. This is not really fun, but whatever. I ordered some SD cards. Since this camera, for some reason, ever so often it says card full when there's nothing. I need to have a backup so I don't have to delete all the footage that I've already taken or transferred if it's too early or I'm not home to transfer the files and lose everything. Content creator problems, what is this? Oh wow, they even put the HelloFresh inside the Best Buy order. That's crazy. This is what you'd consider, I don't know, what kind of grocery store? Caribbean grocery store? No, it's Chinese. Oh. Chinese, but it's got Caribbean stuff in it. That makes all the sense. So we're looking for, I don't know what, what because we're trying to call to find out what spices we need. And of course, the person we're calling, the phone is dead. It's been so long since I've been able to see one of these. But that's what people use when they want to find something in an aisle. I, on the other hand, have to memorize in certain grocery stores where things are and continue to go back to that grocery store. And when I go somewhere brand new, I go through literally every single aisle. So thank God for my brother. Hi, I'm Alicia here with Fable. We are gonna be doing the Aura Ring test for today. And the slug is O-U-R. What we're gonna do is start off by taking our three fingers and double tapping twice. I always like to start at the top left hand of the screen to make sure I don't miss anything. I can see the logo of the company here. It is thin font, but of course it is their logo, so it's gonna be that way. Take my three fingers and double tap again to ensure that we have changed the page, which we have, because it indicates that we're now on the shop page. I wanna see if the pinch and zoom option works, which it does, this is great. I can tell immediately that this is a very aesthetic site with its tan background and white text. Italicized is beautiful from an aesthetic perspective, but it's really hard when you're visually impaired and you're trying to pan across. But if you take your time with it or you continue to pinch and zoom as you can, 
it would probably be easier to use a pinch and zoom to continue to pan versus the three fingers, which sometimes locks out at the end of the screen. As we're going down, we can see that the colors do change to indicate different features of the product, which is really good. I see a, lot, a large blurb of text, and when it comes to be visually impaired, you don't want to read something that you're not necessarily looking for. So let's see if there is a title or an indication that this is exactly what we're looking for. I really like that there are icons to indicate that you are about to read a blurb related to pinpointing something or durability. This makes it really easy for us to decide and discern that if we're gonna zoom in, we're zooming in on the right thing. Because maybe we do wanna know the longevity, but maybe we're not so interested in durability. It's also really good that it's in bullet point form, starting to populate kind of like an infinity feed, which is very easy on the eye. And I pinch and zoom, I'm gonna to have to hold it closer to me in order to see. I like that the typography, the font they've used is very, very clean for any of the describing attributes of the product because whether you pinch and zoom or you double tap in, it doesn't get pixelated and it's very clear to see what the O's and the A's are, which can be tricky sometimes. I like that they have pictures in between that are clickable so you can pinch and zoom. A lot of sites don't allow you to zoom into their photographs. The photographs are a little pixelated so you can't read that it says redesign. It's kind of hard to read small font in front of a moving picture but it is really beautiful. So it's kind of like a hard trade off. Thanks for listening to my review. So that is how you do an accessibility test for websites and apps. Let me take this out. So this has been my, I guess you could call it side gig for the last three years. Well, actually it's 2024. The way the other testers snatch these up so quick, I think because a lot of visually impaired people don't work. Constant renovations in this apartment. Speaking of aesthetics, they're making my building even more beautiful. So I can't be mad. But what am I trying to say? I lost my train of thought. Oh, so basically, if you're visually impaired and you're looking to get a little extra coin or you're having a hard time getting a Thank God this did not happen during the test though. Okay, can I talk? Cause I quickly, I just wanna wrap this up. It comes down to being unemployed or getting a little bit of coins. I would personally do something like this and it gives you a lot of efficacy cause it feels like what you're going through, you're going through for a reason because the more you share about how hard it is to use your iPhone or your computer, cause there's tests for desktop too, the more you pay it forward, the more you're able to give these companies information to make sites better for all the champions. I'ma take a bougie, to a deal with it, let her pick up whatever she want. CC Gucci, he will take up whatever she want. She pissed me off, so how she still get paid. How do your sets bigger than my whole apartment? Hopefully you can hear me with the construction outside and the fridge rumbling. I have never walked as fast as I could in my life because just as I was getting on the train, I was like, cycle started. And you see what color pants I'm wearing. I try to go to the washroom in the subway when I change tracks out of service. I didn't want to go to the washroom anyways. It's all this filthy and stinky. Hello and young, if you know, you know. Because I don't know what people do when they leave the house, but they shouldn't do it there. Luckily, I got home a couple seconds ago. I checked. And I am blessed. <laughs> Which is why I haven't changed yet. But that was a close call. I seen this on Zara last week, like on the website. It looks a little stretched out to me. I used to work at Zara for, what, two, three years when I was in university. So if I know anything, some in that factory warehouse uniformity is not really a thing and then this top was sold out otherwise I would have just ordered both off the app I have some intentions for this set I can wear it end to end and put a belt in between it'll give a very elevated I'll show you a picture of what I'm trying to do I saw a similar set on JLux label for a lot more perhaps because the fabric is sateen way nicer or I can hike it up and do you know my typical cropped vibe I got a replacement glass for the one we broke 
a week ago. Was it a week ago or two weeks ago? I don't know. Life is Dubai and it happens all the time. The guy's like, you only want one? Yeah. Do you want it in a bag? No. <laughs> Can you please put it in a box? And you saw as I came home, it flipped on the floor. So.